the format of being robot. How do I explain this? Seriously, how do I explain this weird event I've run into about the most talked about creepypasta? Well, I guess I can start slow. The original Spongebob bootleg creepypasta is the story about five teenagers who found a bootleg episode of Dumped that was heavily distorted and heavily damaged which lead to this face. The most popular lost episode next to Squidward's suicide. Of course, the original was fake, but the events that I've suddenly run into Oh god, that's what I kept saying thinking about this distorted and uncomfortable alternate version of the episode, dumped. I'm thankful I was able to get this recorded on my camcorder. Around March of 2023, I was watching old rerun episodes of SpongeBob SquarePants. I've become so attracted to the reruns that I've forgotten what time it was. I was about to get up and go to bed when the song, Daytime Drama, played from the episode dumped. Fine, one more episode and I can go to bed. I sat down and watched the episode. Outside of the flickering and the occasional buggy pixels, the episode played as normal, until the infamous scene from the bootleg. At the time, I grabbed my camera, and quickly pressed the record button. As Spongebob was asking Patrick if he wanted fresh scent or heavy duty like in the original, the Nick logo vanished, replaced with a black blob. Where did the logo go? I said horrified. Suddenly, when Spongebob was just about to cry out the last word, he stopped. His eyes were noticeably red, and he had a small frown, oh no, here it comes. Suddenly, a loud distorted sound, slowly enraptured the speakers, as Spongebob's face scrunched inwards before it snapped to black. I was visibly horrified, but that wasn't all. When the episode came back, Spongebob had a sad face, but the color aspect was grayscale, with a voice in the background belittling Spongebob. I was able to piece the insults together, and came across this. Alright, that does it. I screamed as I grabbed the remote, and shut the TV off. I stopped into my room, and then I suddenly started getting into a tirade on how these mysterious voices were bullying Spongebob, and how they were ungrateful narcissists, saying these uncalled messages to him. Then, just as I was about to go to bed, something flashed in my head. The logo. It doesn't normally vanish during an episode, unless it's going to a commercial break. Quickly, I opened my laptop, and looked up the Spongebob bootleg episode's story, and the supposed version of Dumped. The story and the alternate airing didn't line up with the story, however, the footage that was shown was edited, which meant Nickelodeon aired an edit of a Spongebob episode. To this day, who knows what will happen next. <laughs>